The Pacific Ocean is literally boiling L. A marine heatwave dub. The blog from 2015 is back, and it's bigger than ever, stretching 5,000 miles from Japan to America. This is the most strange marine heat event in over a century, and it's changing the rules of climate and ecology. Sea surface temperatures are high. Japan just hit an all-time record of 107.2 degrees Fahrenheit or 41.8 degrees Celsius. On the U.S. West Coast, strange weather is already brewing, disrupted winds, oppressive humidity, and possible winter chaos. Imagine an ocean so hot it's literally boiling the rules of nature. Neat, the blob, a monster marine heatwave stretching 5,000 miles from Japan to California, and it's rewriting Asia's winter in 2025. Buckle up, because this is climate change in real time. This isn't just warm water, it's a record breaker. Sea surface temps are up to 10 degrees Fahrenheit hotter than normal, with Japan hitting a scorching 107.2 degrees Fahrenheit air temp this summer, fueled by ocean heat. The blog's back, bigger than its 2015 rampage, and it's already shaking things up. So, what's this mean for Asia's winter? It's a wild card. East Asia, Japan, Korea, China, brace for a roller coaster. A strengthening East Asian winter monsoon could slam you with Siberian chills, dropping temps to minus 30 degrees Celsius in Mongolia. But the blob's warm waters. They're juicing up storms, dumping heavy snow on Japan's ski slopes and flooding coastal areas with humidity. South Asia, you're not off the hook. India and Pakistan might see milder winters, but drier plains could spark drought fears. Himalayan snow's looking good for water reserves, but early melts are a risk. Southeast Asia, get ready for a wetter, warmer season, think floods in the Philippines and sneaky late-season typhoons. The scariest part, the blob's killing marine life. Back in 2015, it starved millions of seabirds and sea lions, crashed fisheries, and left some species gone for good. In 2025, fish are fleeing, plankton's vanishing, and toxic algal blooms could spike food prices across Asia. Why's this happening? It's a triple threat. El Nino's fading war, quirky high-pressure systems, and, yep, human-driven climate change. The Pacific's warming 54% faster than a century ago, and cleaner shipping rules are ironically trapping more heat. This isn't a one-off, it's a preview of our future. Winter 2025 could be a turning point. Will the blob cool off, or will it fuel chaos, wild storms, snowy mountains, or fishery collapses? Asia, you're on the front lines. Stay sharp, check local forecasts, and let's top solutions, cut emissions, save our oceans, now. What's your winter looking like? Drop a comment and let's sound the alarm together. This is the Pacific's wake-up call, don't sleep on